Hello, class, how are you? Hello. Hi, Hi Claudia. Yes or no, it's hot today. Yes. When is the rainy season going to start? Uh, because of the the niño, it's a, it's a, it started already. But I I imagine it was going to start like like um now like it should be raining hard now. Mm -hmm. But because of el niño, mm -hmm. it's a dry. Uh, what, ha what happened with El Nino? Is a uh, sequia. Oh, there's a dry? Uh -huh. So there's not going to be any rain? Yes, but not like a lot. It's supposed to be right now. Oh. Mm -hmm. Because we, ha we, we should see many rains right now but because of that oh no that's not good mm -hmm. oh okay what are you eating Claudia gel <laughs> what gel oh those jelly Yes. Jelly can. Did you get those in your job? No. No. Okay. Hello, Angela. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Um, very well, teacher. And you? How are you? I'm good. It's I'm very hot today. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's it's very hot today. Ronald. Yes, what, yes. Yeah. Hello, Ronald. How are you? Hi, everything. It's okay. I was just taking a nap, but I just woke up. You were taking a nap? Yes, because I couldn't sleep very well yesterday. So it was hot and I didn't have any obligations today. So I took advantage of it and I took a nap. Um, do you think you can sleep later tonight? Yes, uh, it, it will be, I mean, if I take a shower, it will be easier, <laughs> so I will, I will try. <laughs> yeah. Otherwise, uh, I would play, uh, I was downloading a new, it's not, it's not new the video game, but it's new for me because I haven't played it before, so I'm excited to, to play it today at least perhaps one hour it's it's the it's mines Morales spider-man oh so you play online you play on, on the internet I usually buy video games uh, online because they are cheaper that cost me six dollars oh, okay you oh you, and and how long can you play them uh, that one, like, as long as I pay the the subscription, the PlayStation Plus, it allows you to play it as long as it, it is active. And I have paid, like, six months now. So I got, I mean, I, I think I will be able to complete it in the next six months. Okay. Very interesting. Interesting. What's up, Bert? How are you? Hey, good evening, sir. I, I, I'm okay, but the thing is, it's hot over here. I oh, mean, yes. I have the fan on. This is on the show. I don't, I don't like the fan, but I need it right now. No, but there's something today that is extremely hot. To, today is hotter than normal. Yeah. 
it seems it's gonna rain, but maybe that's the reason it's so hot right now. I think I'm going to take a shower today before I go to sleep. Because it really is hot. All right. So let's do yesterday. We're doing connecting ideas. Let me see. Connecting ideas. Do, 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 do. Let me share my screen. I'm sorry, this is what we did yesterday. If you ask me, uh-huh. So here we have lesson objective. This is a tag question. Do you know what a tag question is? It was like when you when you confirm the when you, when you confer something but you seeing like the verb to be like it's hot here, now here. isn't it or something like that if I'm not wrong okay okay that's one it is a tag question. Who else uh, understands what a tag question is? Somebody else? I'm going to play your game today. I'm going to be quiet too. Okay, listen. Why? <laughs> <laughs> a, a tag question is, of course, it's a question, but you're not positive. Or you are positive. Okay, Ronald, yes, his idea was good. This is... This is, saben que en buen salvadoreño es vea. ¿Cuándo terminamos vea? Hey Ronald. <laughs> hey Ronald, ten, vos tenés 22 uh, años, ¿verdad? Yes, that's correct. Well, actually, en salvadoreño es, hey, vos tenés 22 años, va. Va. Uh, you're trying to confirm the information. Yes, I'm trying to confirm, but really, I'm not. I'm not 100 sure, but I am 90 percent sure. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? Yes, you, you kind of assumed. Uh, mm -hmm. I am assuming. Yeah, that I think yes, I am. I don't know if it's 21 or 22, but I'm positive it's 22, but I'm not 100 percent sure. So I say, hey, Ronald. You are 22, aren't you? Okay, so. Let me see the chat. What do you see right now on my screen? The notepad. Notepad, okay. Yeah, no, hold on, let's use another one. Hold on. Yo, yo. <laughs> What's up, yo, yo? 
who's yo yo yeah yo yo <laughs> you know that Amer black american oh speaking yeah <laughs> well, shut that's so funny yo yo mm -hmm. yo yo okay do you see my screen now yeah no, you had to word the key. Oh, okay good Okay, look, so you are, what is the negative? No, it's the contraction. What the hell? Okay. The the affirmative is you are. What's next here? Sorry, teacher. What was the question? Thank you. What is after you are? What goes next? Can I say you are drink? No, I think that it oh. should be you are drunk. Okay, you are drunk. What else? You are funny. You are good. You are happy. Stuff like that. Good. You're my friend. You are my friend. Okay, so when we say you are, next is a description, correct? Yes. Yes. So next we put a noun, a noun or an adjective. A noun, because I can say you're a doctor, you're a teacher, you're a policeman. Or you can say an adjective. Like um, like Dennis said, you are happy, you are ugly, you are beautiful, you are tall, you are short. Correct? Yes, yes. Okay, so this is a tag question. I asked Jonathan. Yes, it's... you. Uh, I'm sorry, I asked Dennis. Ronald, sorry. You are 22. You're 22, aren't you? So yes. what happens, a tag question is, if you notice, I started, I started negative or positive? Positive. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, uh, it's, it's affirmative. So I started affirmative, you are 22, correct? And I finished with a question. Aren't you? So if if you start with an affirmative statement, do you know what a statement is? Like, like a what? It's like an affirmation. Yes, it's an affirmation. Good. If you start with an affirmative statement, you finish with a negative question. If you start with a negative statement, you finish with a positive question. With an affirmative question, I'm sorry. So in this case, I really don't remember, Ronald, I am positive, what's that? I am sure he said 22. But I am not 100% sure. Pero, yeah, because si estuviera seguro, no le preguntara, obviamente, right? O le preguntara, how old are you? But I remember, yeah, he's 22 because I remember he said, so I asked him, hey, um, Ronald, you are 22, aren't you? 
And the answer is yes, I am. No, I'm not. Who can who can give me this question in negative and finish positive? Me, Could teacher. Be... All right, go ahead. Uh, I'm sorry. Go ahead, please. Go ahead, Angelica. Aren't you 22? Are you? Okay, listen to what you said. Okay, good try. Good. Aren't you 22? Are you? The problem here, Angelica, is that there are two questions. This is a question, aren't you 22? And this is a question, are you? So it's not correct because we have, but you have the idea. Let me see, Dennis, what is the correct? You are not, or you aren't 22, are you? Good, hold on, let me see. So let, let's see. You aren't 22, are you? Yep. So, yes, this is correct. Look, Angelica. You aren't 22. Yes. Are you? So, remember, a tag question is an affirmation and a short question. Está bien duro mi teclado. Okay, tag question. What is a tag question? Oops. What is a tag question? Is this. Let's change the color. A tag question is an affirmation and a short question. So here, affirmation, you are 22. What is a short question? Aren't you? Here, you aren't 22. What is the affirmation? I'm 22, are you? Okay, look. It's an affirmation. Let's change the color. And a short question. One, two. Once again, you are 22. Is this a question or an affirmation? Affirmation. An affirmation. Okay, an good. Affirmation. So, aren't you is the short question. Entonces, yes, it is a tag question. Or you did an affirmation and a short question. So here, you aren't 22. Are you? What is the short question? Uh, the, are you? Good. Are you? What is the affirmation? Yeah. Affirmation or... You are in 22. You are in 22. Okay. If we do not understand what affirmation and short question is, we will not understand the next step. Um, Claudia, ask Bert something. Dígale algo que usted sabe de él. And... Albert and give him an affirmation. No, no question, yes? an affirmation. Give him an affirmation. Uh, you work at Concentric, aren't you? No, wait, wait, wait. No, only the only the confirmation. Ah, you work at Concentris. Hey, Concentrics is with an X, right? Yes. Okay, you work in, in concentrics. Que falta? 
the short question. The short question. Don't you? Okay, that was very good, Claudia. Hey, uh, ahora paso número dos. Para hacer esta pregunta hay, hay que tener estilo. Nunca, nunca les ha pasado algo que necesitan de repente de, de un técnico, de un mecánico, de un doctor y se quedan, hey, necesito, necesito un... No, 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 no. Ajá, y necesito a alguien que me ayude en el software. Hey, Allison, tú sos developer, ¿verdad? Yes, I am. Good. Did, did you see that, my scenario? In this situation is when we ask a tag question. Like, hey, Allison, you are, you are an administrator. Sorry. Allison, you are a web developer, aren't you? Yes, I am. <laughs> oh, good. Look, I need your help. Can you help me? Good. And then you continue the conversation. But this is very different if I say, I need a web developer. Allison, <laughs> you are a web developer, aren't you? You see, number one is boring. So you're being boring as number two. So even robotico, you, you need style, okay? So, do you have questions in this moment? Attack question. No, teacher. Okay. Then I no, have but, a question. Okay, what is your question, Jonathan? The the tense is simple present. Oh, okay, good. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, good. I okay. Don't worry. I will answer that. But right now, do you understand what a tag question is? Yes. Okay. It only has two components: an affirmation and a short question. Si yo digo esto, do you work? Do you work in concentrics? Is this a tag question? No. No. Why? No. No, it's not. This is a normal question. <laughs> no. This is a normal question. Now, if there was an affirmation, like you work in concentrics, don't you? Okay. Step number two. If the affirmation is positive, the question is negative. Correct? Yes, teacher. So I read mathematics first. So listen, okay, so the affirmation, if the affirmation is positive, if the affirmation is positive, the question is negative. If the affirmation is negative, the question is positive, correct? Correct, teacher. Okay, so before we continue, and because next is Jonathan's question. So in this case, Dennis, please ask a question to whoever you want. Uh, the last one, teacher. No, ask or a tech, new one. Ask a tech question. It's your option. Okay, let's see. Um, Jonathan. Are you 25 years old? 
aren't you? I'm sorry, no. It, it must be, you are 25 years old, aren't you? Okay, let's see if this is correct. Jonathan, you are 25 years old, aren't you? No. This is the most fácil de respuesta because it's yes or no. <laughs> okay, so you are 25 years old, aren't you? Ahora, otra cosa muy importante, ¿cómo saber si empiezo afirmativo o negativo? Digo en español. Claudia Girón. Usted no está casada, ¿verdad? No. <risa> y si yo le digo, Claudia Girón, usted está casada, ¿verdad? La respuesta siempre es no. But what is the difference? Uh -huh. ¿Por qué lo puedo hacer en dos formas? Porque de, depende qué tan seguro estoy yo de mi pregunta. Si yo estoy seguro que no lo está, pero no estoy 100% seguro, empiezo negativo. Porque yo sé que no lo está. Pero no sé, no me acuerdo muy bien. Entonces, Claudia, you're not married, are you? No. No, I am not. No, I am not. Now, um, Alison, I think she took, uh, Alison, you are married, aren't you? Yes, I am. Okay, good. You see the difference? Okay, so uh, uh, Jonathan, ask somebody, please. Um, to Alison? Okay. Alison, you are a popense, aren't you? No, I'm not. Así se dice la gente, sí, a popense o... o... Yes. <laughs> okay. All right, nice. You are a popense, aren't you? No, I'm not. Very good. Allison, ask somebody except Dennis and Jonathan. Uh, well, uh, Albert. <laughs> um, you live in San Miguel, don't you? Me? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yes. yes. Oh, okay, sorry, Mike. I mean, yes, I do. <laughs> oh, listen, so, I'm sorry. So, after you are, what's next? A description, correct? Description. Correct? Yes. So uh -huh, after you are, next is a description. Okay. So what is a description, a noun, or an adjective? Correct? Yes, sir. Okay. Now. What if I say you sing R? What's next? Verb. 
Exactly. So lo look at the difference. You are a description. You, a verb. So, don't you forget about me? Don't, 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 don't you? Están muy jóvenes para saber cuál canción es esa. Pero ya la han oído, ¿no? You don't or don't you? The song, don't you? You never heard that song? Don't you forget about I'm here. me. I'll be here. No, I never. I have it, never. That, that is a classic song. Man. When you stand up. Do you like 80s music? Yes, I, I do. do. Yeah. yeah. But you know, let's say to Claudia, Allison, and Ronald, I really recommend you, you should listen to music from the 80s. It's the best pop music. I, I, I think 80s was the best in everything, in rock, pop, movies, everything. Mm, I disagree in rock. <laughs> in rock? Why? Do you like rock? I I like rock, but some not not all the rock, not all the genre. For example, I love the rock from the ninety. No, it's I, quite yeah. different to the rock to the eighty because you, for example, you if you compare Axel Roses, the Guns N' Roses, and Nirvana, they're so different. Yeah, yeah. but but. Okay, but I think, in my opinion, rock died in the name in the '90s, when those ugly bands like Limp Bizkit, um, ¿cómo se llama? It? Linkin Park and Papa Roach and all those stupid bands, they ruined rock because they started making hip hop with rock and no sé qué, blah, blah. <laughs> because in the '80s. You had good rock. You had Guns N' Roses. You had ACDC, Bruce Springsteen, uh, Scorpions, Metallica. Metallica, U2, Bon Jovi. I mean, all the bands. Estaban en su prime. And yes, and in the 90s, Pearl Jam, Nirvana, aún estábamos bien. And then, boom, Blink-182 y todas estas bandas. Yeah, so, yeah, but, but you know, every, every... But anyways, so when you say you, you say a verb. You like, you work, you live, you eat. Okay, so la misma regla. You live in San Miguel. Don't you? No, wait, wait. But I remember, no, no, no. He doesn't live exactly in San Miguel. Um, Bert, you live in the outside of San Miguel, don't you? Yeah, I live in the outside San Miguel. And now it's San Miguel Centro. <laughs> oh, now it's San Miguel, San Miguel. But, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Is it official now? I think so. Mm. It's official. Yes, I think the president signed it already. Oh, okay. So now your mayor will be, um, will be Salgado. <laughs> Will Salgado is your mayor now. Okay. So, yeah, him. So listen, you live in San Miguel, don't you? ¿Quién me lo puede decir en otra forma? You don't live in San Miguel, do you? Exactly. You don't live in San Miguel, do you? Very good. ¿Saben qué de hecho? 
hoy usé bastantes tag questions. I did a lot of tag questions because my wife, she has a friend. And my her, this friend is a girl. She she was a little crazy, you know. She she lived a crazy life. But now she's she's good. And she always met bad men. But she finally met one good man. He was a very good person. So my wife's friend, she's maybe 38. Por ahí. And her boyfriend is 48. But that's okay, that's no problem. Hey, I am almost 48. But there was something strange because this man, he was very... Estaba bien a la moda. You know? He, his hair, you know. And it's good, it's good, but it's very strange in El Salvador and you're 48. So in my opinion, this man was gay. But you know, and I told my wife, you know what? I think I think he is gay. Anna's boyfriend is gay. My wife, you think? I don't know. I don't know. But and not not only because of that. I said he he lives alone, no family, no record, no history. Mm -hmm. But he was a he's a very nice person. So they separated. And today I saw Anna, the friend. I said, hey, how are you? How's your boyfriend? And she told me, con la recepción, like, we finished. And I said, he's gay, isn't he? And she said, yes. Y me quedé, yes. I was like, I'm sorry for you, pero... Sabía que I was right. <laughs> Sabía que era. Pero that was a tag question. Did you see why? Porque yo no estaba 100% seguro, pero I was positive. So that's what I said. Here. He is gay, isn't he? Y me dijo, yes. How do you know? I said, I don't know. It was I just, I just know. <laughs> okay. So um, what happened was that her boyfriend, he had problems with his family. Pobrecito, no, no, no. Pobrecito, man, no, no, no quería salir del closet, creo, con su familia. Y pobrecita ella también porque la usó. Uh -huh. Entonces está deprimida ella que odia a los hombres, dice. Oh, qué <laughs> yeah. Okay, so. Uh, so uh, thank you, Claudia. That was a good question for Bert. You live in San Miguel, don't you? Now, Bert, your turn. Ask somebody with a verb, please. Uh, uh, let me think. Ah, yeah, Allison. Can I ask her? Sure, yeah. Hmm. You love programming in Java, don't you? Alison. Maybe she didn't hear me. She's on sorry, her cell sorry. phone. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that question was for you. Okay. Alison, do you love programming in Java, don't you? Mm, no, I, I, I don't. <laughs> okay, good. Good. You see, this is a very good example. 
Bert assumed that she loved programming in Java. Why did Bert assume that? Because Bert is as uh, he likes systems too, like Allison. So he assumed, but Allison said no. Okay, so good. Allison, ask somebody, please. Um, well, Claudia. Um, I I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, except Claudia, except Bert, somebody who has not participated. I already asked Albert. Ask somebody else. No, que estamos haciendo con verbos. Yeah, I asked Albert. If... Okay, but you have Dalila, you have Jonathan, you have Denia, you have Angelica, you have Angela, you have Dennis, you have many people you can ask. Okay. Again? Okay, it's okay. No, no, no problem, no problem. No worries. Okay, Dennis, can you ask somebody, please, a uh, tag question with a verb? Okay. Um, Angela, do you have one, three children? Don't you? Yes. I have two doors. Okay, was it correct, teacher? No, the question and the answer were terrible. <laughs> okay, <laughs> why? <laughs> Do you have? <laughs> Okay, why is this not correct, class? Because the auxiliary have? No, because she, he said you, he said, do you? This is a question, do you have three children? Two. Dennis, that is a question. Do you like, do you live, do you work, do you oh. have? Yes? Yeah. So yeah, I got it. So here we need to have, just take off the do. You see, you have three children, don't you? Yep. Okay. Two <laughs> questions, yeah, two questions. Yeah, so all, all we needed to erase was the do. Yeah, okay. I forgot it. No, it's okay, it's okay, no, no problem. But that's why we practice, and Angela, 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 Angela. Hello, hello. <laughs> Number one, listen to the three. He said, yeah. you, have, you have three children, don't you? And you said, yes, I have two daughters. Yes, the correct is no. Exactly. Uh -huh. No, I have. No, no, hold on. So the correct is, okay, aquí, aquí Angela va a tener que hablar con ortografía. Yes. <laughs> because look, if you say. No, I have. Oh, no, I have two, two doors. Ajá, pero soy bien raro. But if you say this, no. <laughs> yeah. uh -huh. What? What? Mire lo que hace el punto. Es mágico. <laughs> no, mm -hmm. I okay. have two doors. Okay. No, 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 no. Uh -huh. So the question is, you have three children, don't you? No, I have two no. daughters. Okay, the correct is no, I have two daughters. Exactly, yes. But si usted okay. dice, no, okay. I have two daughters, it's not, what's that? No, punto y aparte, I have two daughters. Exactly. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, you're welcome. You're welcome. Okay, so do you understand Dennis and Angela? Yes, teacher. It's clear for me. All right, good. Remember, hoy también está en un paso que, que uh, no solo están aprendiendo a hablar inglés, pero tienen que ponerle carácter. Yes? Teacher. Yes, Angela. 
And the question, the, co the correct is, have you three children? No. Do you have? No, because a tag question empieza con affirmation uh, and it finishes with a question. Uh, do you have to? No. Uh, Angela, ¿sabe qué es una afirmación? Yes. Okay. So, si usted dice, do you have three children? It's not an affirmation. That's a question. Uh-huh. So it's not correct. Yes. Si quitamos el do, hoy que dice aquí? You have three children. ¿Qué dice ahí? You? Exactly. Tú tienes tres hijos. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. O sea, es okay. como una afirmación. Vea, vea. Vea. Yeah, that, that's it. Salvadoreños, vea. Yeah. Exactly. Uh -huh, okay. Angela. Entonces eso es una affirmation. Entonces él le estaba preguntando Dos preguntas. Le estaba haciendo dos preguntas. Do you have three children? Don't you? Ajá. Uh -huh. okay. Okay. okay, very good. Okay. okay, Angela, ask somebody, please. Ask Claudia, ask Denia, and Denia, no sé si está en clase hoy. Uh, yeah. Dal Dalila, ask them, please. Dalila. Uh, uh, ask Denia, please. Denia. Do you have a pet? Do you, don't you? Okay, good. This is correct. You have a pet. Let me see. It's an affirmation. Yes. And we finish with don't you, a question. Excellent. Dania, you have a pet, don't you? No. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay. Awesome. Very good. Very good, Angela. Thank you. Dania, your turn. Thank you, teacher. I think. Okay. <laughs> no, very good. Very good. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Qué raro, qué raro, porque esto yo sé que es un poco difícil y esto no le costó mucho. Eh. <laughs> sí, como da vueltas cosas. Nice. Uh, huh? I understand very well. Yeah, I, uh, I understand the, the concept. Yes. <laughs> Good. Okay, go, Dania. Okay, Ronald. Ronald McDonald. <laughs> Hi. Ronald. Mm, you like Barcelona, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> No, I don't, and hey, them. Yeah, but but remember, Denia, he is twenty-two. He's a kid. Okay. <laughs> he do, he doesn't understand. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Very good. Good. Okay, Ronald, your turn. Ask Jonathan. Ask Claudia. Ask Angelica. Hi, Jonathan. You cannot turn on the camera, can you? Mm, can you repeat, please? Uh, hi, I was uh, saying that you cannot turn on the camera, can you? Good question. Mm, yes, I. Yes, I do. <laughs> yes, I can because remember he he said can. So he said you can't turn on the camera, can you? Yes, I can. Okay, class. Um, Dalila is not in class today, is she? Yes. Oh, she is. There I'm she here. is. Hi, Dalila. It was an example. Que parecido a la realidad, you know. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Very good. Okay, class, do you understand what is a tag question? I can say, for example, 
you ate my 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 apple didn't you in past exactly in past yes la misma regla affirmation and short question mm -hmm. let me see Hoy le voy a hacer una pregunta de algo que les gusta. Um, tun, 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 tun. Claudia. Telus is better than concentric, isn't it? Mm. Isn't it? Because listen to my, <laughs> listen, uh, li, li, listen to what I said. Telus is better than concentrics. Isn't it? No, it isn't. Okay, very good. All right. <laughs> um, Ronald. Hi. Hi. Ronald Nazario was better than Ronaldinho, wasn't he? Yes, he was. Yes, he was. By far. Yeah. He was a machine. I And a popular opinion is that Ronaldo da Cis Moreira, the other one, is, is to me, is overrated because he was, he had flair and uh, all he did was, I mean, it was impressive for, for anyone, but he just have a good season, so to me that's overrated, and people oh, always Ronald, get Ronaldinho get mad at me. Yes, he's overrated to me. No, you're right. Because... You're right. I, I I I think the same too. I think he's overrated. He's uh, excellent. He... No, you see that his problem was that he was an excellent. He was a magician, but he he didn't have discipline, so he didn't get far. Yeah, if... but when I say that, people don't. Yeah, they don't understand. don't agree with me because I support Real Madrid, but you're the first person who agree with me. Yeah, no, no, I, I definitely I agree with you. I tell I tell what I tell people is that how many years did Ronaldinho play? He he played good years. He played maybe six. And I said, look at Cristiano Ronaldo, look at Messi. They have played more than 10 years in top condition. So I think that's why. Good. Angelica. Hello. Hi. Angelica, Merliot is not Santa Tecla, is it? Excuse me, I don't understand. Merliot is not Santa Tecla, is it? No. What is I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> but but you live in Santa Tecla, don't you? Hey, tech question. <laughs> you live in Santa Tecla, don't you? No. Where do you live? I don't. I live in Soyapango. Oh yes, you live in Soyapango. I'm sorry. Who lives in Merliot in Soyapango? No. I live in my Santa mother Tecla. lives in Merliot. Oh, okay, yes, it's Denia's mother. So Denia, yeah. is Merliot is Santa Tecla, isn't it? Or Antiguo? Uh, um, I think the Santa Tecla. I always wondered, I always imagined, where does your mother vote? Does she vote for Santa Tecla, uh, por Alcaldía, or what? Hey. Yes, in Santa Tecla. Okay, so, okay. Yes, because the principal part mm -hmm. to the right, for, for, for example, or to the up, I don't know how this, para arriba. Up, yeah. 
is yes up is um, santa tecla and the the principle for down for abajo is mm -hmm. antiguo cuscatlán no 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 wait 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 it be, no 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 because it belongs to santa tecla and it belongs to antiguo cuscatlán right but it's always yes, but, yes Okay. Yes, that, that's what I heard too. I heard that the, the division between Merliot and Santa Tecla is El Platillo, right? The, the Principito Park. Yes. So so let's say the Super Selectos in Principito Park is, is Antiguo. And ¿Qué es lo que es? Premium or Imperium, Imperio? Que está al otro yes. lado. That's Santa Tecla, then, right? Yeah. Entonces, el columpio del principito es antiguo y el sube y baja es Santa Tecla. <laughs> kind of. Saber, saber quién se pelea por él. You know, one thing, Denia, I don't understand why el principito park is famous. I don't know. Because don't know. Oh. really, really, the park is ugly. <laughs> yes. It's... And actually, the mm -hmm. sorry, this week, the past weekend, sorry, mm -hmm. uh, I very disappointed because the parking was, mm -hmm. no sé cómo se dice, están cobrando. Oh, yeah, they charge uh, parking. Yes. And is a park I don't know why paid yeah. for parking. Yes, it's true. The the park is nothing like wow. So uh yeah, what size? I I think it is popular now because when nobody used to pay attention to that that park and they have to take advantage of of that they are popular now because they then perhaps next year nobody will visit that place. It's true. It will pass. I mean, yeah, many people go and the food is good and everything, but really the park itself, I don't know why it's very famous because I think there are better parks like Santa Elena or something. All right. So let me see. I can't put on that on the ultimo. I forgot. Wow, well, yeah, I can start here. Dania, can you ask somebody a question? Dania, Danny, I'm sorry. Yeah, yo, uh, maybe it's me, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ask somebody, Dania. Okay. I, I really you. like your name. Thank you. It, it, because the two names are very different. Yes. Only one letter, actually, but it's too different. Uh, let me see. I asked for... Uh, Claudia number one, I think. Claudia Maria, right? No, Claudia number one is uh, the youngest. Okay, sorry, I was Claudia number two, Claudia Maria. Um, let me see. Do you, sorry, you like uh, eat pupusas, don't you? <laughs> Uh, yes, I love pupusas. Okay, good. Exactly. You like to eat pupusas, don't you? Excellent. Ahora pregúntale a los salvadoreños. Le gustan las pupusas, vea. <laughs> ¿Qué le preguntan a, a su compañero de trabajo cuando viene? Con las pepas bien rojas el lunes en la mañana y así como 
todo mal peinado y oh, y que ya con la paja de oh dormí mal ¿cuál sería la pregunta ahí? You you are with hangover, aren't you? Exactly, yeah. You are hungover, aren't you? No, 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 I slept. You smell like liquor. Huele a níspero. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And what is the number one excuse? No, no, es que dormí mal. Acabo de echar alcohol gel en las manos. Oh, That's yes, why. yes. <laughs> <laughs> It's true. Es el alcohol gel. Okay. Okay, class, we will continue this tomorrow, okay? Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Practiquen tech questions. Thank you, okay. teacher. Yes or no, todos los días los usamos. Okay, thank you. Recuerden una cosa, pero si ya están... 100% seguros de la pregunta que van a hacer, no es necesario usar tag questions, sino que solo afirmar de un solo. Ese amigo que apesta guaro, le van a decir un solo, hey, anda de goma. Hey, you are hungover. Ya ni es pregunta, just an affirmation. Hmm. Yes. Okay, class, then thank you very much. Have a wonderful day. Night. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Bye bye. Good night. Bye bye.